When the band performs this song to tens of thousands of Armenians on Tuesday, the crowd will know how to sing it back. My Step has become the anthem for a revolution. Haik Stver composed the music. We came to the conclusion that it needed to be in a courageous rock style, as the song is a call to step up. Those steps should constantly be heard in the music. Penned by opposition leader Nikol Pashinyan, the lyrics, along with his protest walk, inspired thousands of Armenians to join the movement, forcing the resignation of former President and Prime Minister Serge Sarkisyan and bringing Pashinyan to the threshold of power. Or you are going back. Smart young Armenians, such as Haik and his brother, have led a highly effective image-driven campaign. Our success has many, many, many details, you know, uh, about this, um, his uh, image. Mukhtar helped craft Pashinyan's non-violent, revolutionary persona. The dress code of the people who should join us, his beard, yeah, that we didn't allow him to, to shave. All the details we discussed, so we had the plan. In Yerevan's street stalls, you can pick up a Pashinyan t-shirt or a baseball cap that says, have courage. Nikol Pashinyan and his movement's messaging has been so effective, they've become like a brand. Placards like Rubin Malayan's have become the pop art of the movement. It is perceived as a brand, so, um, but I, I, I don't like the, the, the rigid uh, framework of, of that. We're not selling anything. We're just trying to set ourselves free from, uh, from tyranny. Opposition organizers are now providing him with his paint, but the inspiration, Ruben says, is his alone. I'm trying through filtering through myself, kind of express what my friends are feeling, what people are feeling uh, on, on the street. And when people see that, those works, they emotionally connect to it. So it becomes a dialogue. Armenians are both connecting and communicating with this culture, a culture of resistance. Robin Forrestier-Walker, Al Jazeera, Yerevan.